Hello y'all. Welcome to part 6 of my Kingdom of Manitoba playthrough in the Hearts of Iron 4 mod Old World Blues. In part 5, war broke out between the Duchy of Langenberg and the Kingdom of Manitoba. Also, our annoying rival, the Republic of Three Rivers, took a demilitarized state that was under our control called Porto Prairie. And don't worry, we'll definitely repay the favor to them later. Most They'll get their payment back in full for what they just did to us. And right now our main priority is breaking through the enemy lines in not Yorkton, but in Roblin here, and then moving down into Langenberg and Yorkton, and depriving our enemy of the industrial capacity to wage war, and then also get some encirclements done probably. Stop recruiting as many divisions, we need more troops though. Bring this unit over here, and then increase the amount of units in the infantry battalion, just the infantry division template to 20 combat with. There we go, just break through here, come on. And also bring out this ship here. The Claustrophobes Dream, what a ship name, and have it merge with the rest of our navy that is giving support here, I believe. Yeah, they're helping break through against Earl Grey. Is that his name? I guess, yeah, Earl Grey. Just defeat Earl Grey. Please. And we have three separate attacks going on. Army 2 consists of our special forces and motorized, and their goal is to simply break through and have this army here. Okay. Do we need to move? Yeah, give Army 1 one more division. And we're just attacking right now. We need more troops and manpower. I'm trying to limit how many divisions we really have being made currently because manpower is a premium for us currently. The enemy is kind of stuck in their capital at this time. Some of their divisions are. Please overwhelm the enemy here. Come on, we're so close. So close. So close. Can we use force attack anymore? Not yet. We're just trying to overwhelm them and break through these lines with some success, some failures. And our main goal is just to break through this one area, even though they may try to reinforce it. Once we break through here and cross the river, this frozen body of water, we should be able to start move inward into the interior of the Duchy of Langenberg and force the enemy to spread out more if they want to maintain control over all their provinces. And we need more manpower probably. I need to definitely get a marshal commander of the army, please. Who we get as the chief of the army? Get the jack of all trades, Grayson Hauser, who's also one of our commanders. And so, well, Grayson Hauser is one, and so is Alexander Grimaldi. Fine, give them one, fine. Get another operative here. Get who is this? Howard Hayes? They have some nice traits, so use them. Start building up an intel network in Build up an Intel network in Yorkton, please. That'd be great. And come on, break through here. Go, go, go. Break through, my goodness. And attack Roblin more. Just to prevent any type of reinforcements. And our opponent for some reason wants to keep guarding the Assiniboine River, even though they can't cross it. Keep attacking, go, go, go. Don't get any divisions destroyed, though. That'd be terrible. And I need to do something in the focus tree. What am I doing? Start doing loyalty onto death. And let me read that here. Oh, do not weep, loving mother, for the life of your soldier. For they gave their beings so that yours may continue. Oh, do not cry, protecting father, for the safety of your soldier. For they gave theirs so that you may keep yours. Oh, do not mourn, caring sibling, for your soldier... Now rest with their brothers and sisters in arms, so that you may never need to join them. And this will modify the Royal Banner National Spirit and provide more buffs to the Spec Ops of the Kingdom of Manitoba. We need to break through this line here. It shows some potential. Once we break through, we need to exploit that to, as to the best of our ability and just make sure the enemy does not recover from the punch we're giving them. And we definitely need more manpower. Come on. We're nearly through. Come on, come on, come on. Break through. Go, go, go. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Is we break through? Yes, no, not yet. Oh, come on, we're so close. We need to take this territory, then take Langenberg. Most likely, that's the plan. Can we use force assault? Yes, yes, we can. Punch through. So close to the breakthrough here. Cross the river. Come on, yes, yes, yes. Yes. Come on, break Earl Grey in their one division. One division remains. Get them out of the way. Toss them aside. How is... Okay, good, we made it. Now, let's zoom, zoom, zoom here. Two motorized divisions. Well, they're cavalry. They're light cavalry, technically. They're called light cavalry. The Langruth Cal Cavalry and the 
Meadow Cavalry will spread out and the Special Forces will move to the south and start approaching the capital of Langenberg of our enemy. And that men in arms force we have will just take some territory here and have this division put some pressure on the enemy here. Whoops, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, so they're going to be moving some divisions forward, it seems. Pin down that one division. Make sure you don't have anyone in the way. It looks like they may have some motorized moved in in an attempt to stop us. It's not going very well, honestly. Their stats are not very good. I don't know why. Maybe they just didn't make any motorized. And we need to just spread out the enemy line as much as possible. And for now, let us just reduce the amount of effort. Well, we don't have any occupied territory. But when we, when we finally occupy any of their territory, we won't attempt to. They're going to try and stop us, really. You're not going to stop the special forces hammer of death approaching enemy lines. Your territory now, it's over. We have broken through. There's no stopping the Kingdom of Manitoba's elite force punching through the southern lines. We've got to take Langenberg. And once we do that, we have a crossing we can take advantage of. They have a special force in our way. Who is this? The Spec Ops Division. Get rid of them. Just dispose of them. Yeah, there we go. Motorized took some terrain. But we need more divisions down here, please. And we need more manpower also, I think. Come on. Break through here, have this one infantry division help out and push toward Langenberg. Their spec ops do not seem to be too well equipped, which is fine by me, honestly. And we're trying to take advantage of our naval presence in the Assiniboine River and just ensure we can break through somewhat. Come on, push this unit here. Our goal is to take Langenberg. Maybe we can get an encirclement going, I don't know. Potentially, may not, may be able to. Yeah, if we attack these guys here, maybe it could be doable. Maybe not. The enemy's trying to go on the offensive. It's not going very well. We need more. What do we need? We need dogs. Make some dogs here, game. I need to make some dogs. Make some dogs, I guess, because we're needing more equipment. And can these units please get into position? I guess not. Not yet, anyway. And the special forces continue their assault. Use force attack as soon as possible. Enemy's trying to go on the offensive. It doesn't really make a difference, though. And this is definitely not going to the plans of not going well for the Actually, have these guys focus here. We're getting encirclement going, yeah. Just have one division pin down that one infantry unit and try and push around and take Langenberg by encircling it and capture and destroy any units we can get our hands on there. So the enemy's going on the offensive. Doesn't work very well at all. And as long as we can keep making a wider front line, we're having a fun time. We're going to lose that territory, though. Okay, have one of these divisions move over, please. Very clearly having problems holding on to that province. They're going to be forced to retreat. Whatever. Okay, so we've lost a province. We pushed through. We can still encircle. We can still encircle. Try and get that done. Woodworking has been researched. Go to the research tree now. Start researching, maybe. Research. Go to the military here. Start researching. Warrior equipment. That's way too advanced, actually. Don't worry about it. Start researching instead. Research. I don't know. Clay working. Get that done. Just break through, please, guys. You have one job. One job, and that is to succeed in a breakthrough and capture Langenberg, or at the very least surround Langenberg, honestly. And can you do that? Can you do that one objective we have to give you here? So one unit's going to break through, good. Pause briefly and have this unit try and move to the south, pin them down, have this unit, one of them's going to move up. Good, we just need to surround Langenberg, ultimately. That is the game plan. This unit moved in, good, take Langenberg, flank that unit and capture it. Captured his city and encircled the one troop protecting it. And we're watching that front. The enemy cannot break through too well anywhere else, which is fine by me. As long as they're like basically doing the equivalent of throwing their soldiers out a wall, I am happy. And can they stop attacking so much there? I guess not. I gotta maybe change up the front we're in here, take that province. Good, they're gonna try and fight to the last there at that port, whatever. And just take Langenberg, it's lost. They, we captured it. I need to maybe move some more divisions around. We need more motorized, perhaps. The enemy seems to be trying to move some units in to try and hold on. Just make sure you don't recapture Langenberg. That's all you got to do. Very good. That unit is encircled, though. So bring out all the divisions we have for Army 1. Make sure they hold the big line there. And Army 2 will focus entirely on attempting to encircle this unit here and trying to hold the lines perhaps have these spec ops be more useful down here or they're having issues now my goodness please break through the enemy lines all you gotta do is break one division they're stuck on the coast here not the coast but they're stuck on the Cinnaboyne River royalty onto death is royalty onto death is done destroy this one division all you gotta do 
That one division's watching that. Good. Just make sure we don't lose any territory, please, is all you gotta do. Or if we lose territory, make sure it isn't much. Complete the focused upstart. And that there says... I need to probably read this now because we're at a war. We're in a war. Brought into... Brought in because of his remarkable skills with animals, William Tanner's... William Tanner started his rise as a humble beastmaster in the Crown's service, continuously distinguishing himself and being promoted past what many would view his proper station, not through political not through political ties, but merit alone. And so he's a very skilled beastmaster, I guess. And we're gonna lose this territory here. Don't lose territory, guys. Come on. We need more units, though. I know that much. Manpower is definitely becoming an issue, so are guns. We please encircle this division. They're on a coast. They're at a port, though, which is very annoying. We please focus on them. Take them out. Destroy them. You have one job. One job. They take that province, though. How annoying. They're going to try and hold on to Langenberg, it seems. We cannot... Oh, we have an empty province here? Or no, that's a division, actually. Never mind. Just keep holding the line here. And this is so annoying. They have all their spec ops rushing in. I meant to have an encirclement going better than how it's going now. But things did not work out to our favor. Let's just say that. Even though we are holding back the enemy still. That is the best we can do currently. Can you please take that province? Please take that province away from those spec op guys. And see what we can do after that. Come on, drive out those spec ops. Drive them back. Go, go, go. And trap this unit again. Why do they have to be at a port? Come on, they're trapped there. Do not let them get resupply. Whatever you do. They have nowhere they can flee. Just make sure they can't run away. You have one job. One. One job. How's the pushes everywhere else going? Everything's holding for now. Or at the very least, we're holding at a somewhat decent rate. Destroy this division. Focus all efforts on destroying it. And Spec Ops, you have one task here in front of you. Destroy those two divisions. Goodness gracious, they brought in reinforcements? Or did they deploy more troops there? I don't know. Just please get rid of those divisions. They're going to be a nuisance if we don't destroy them here and now. My goodness. And have these units attack here also. Don't lose Langenberg because you guys don't stop moving. How irritating. Have one unit focus on those guys. They can't do anything. Okay, focus on just destroying that one, those two divisions here. And hold on to Langenberg, please. Don't lose that province in front of Langenberg. They have motorized moving in though, so they may outpace them. That is bad. How's everything else going? Holding for now. Just holding. And those units will not go down without a fight. I'll give them that much. But they have to be encircled in such an awkward place for us. They're out of port. Which is not what I wanted at all. Because we need that port, honestly. We need it. We really need it. At least we took away Langenberg, which is important for them in terms of supplies. But everything else... Okay, we're winning there slowly but surely. I need more manpower, though, I think. And how's that one division we brought with us doing? Come on, we have the Navy there as well. It's not enough to apparently destroy them. How is the Navy doing? We got a new ships. No new ships. We can get some infantry perks. What do we want? Supply use, supply use. It's both for supply use. Help out with the spec ops here or no. Just help out with the infantry. Fine, because we need to use up a lot of pipe guns to help out with things. Please destroy these units so we can punch more into Yorkton and take their territory to the south as they struggle to greatly push anywhere along our lines, really. Which is something I'm not complaining about too much. Why do they have to be on a port tile, really? Can we keep them one division? Keep the one division we have down here. Just lock those guys in, please, actually. I have a new plan. Where's this one division we have to have? Bring that division down here. Do that. And just, I gotta wait for that unit to get in position, though. Come on. Come on. Stop attacking everything, please. I may just have one division just pin down those guys at the port and have the rest try and move more into Yorkton's territory. This is a war that's going to all be... Fo it's going to be very focused on who can get the most encirclements because the numbers are about equal, at least just taking them at face value. And can we push here at all? Yes, we can. Drive back those militia. And how's that infantry unit doing? They're taking forever. Don't lose the province. Stop moving to help with the province. My goodness, move up here. You're defending this line, not that one. Don't worry about the encircled guys. We'll have one division just watch them, I guess. It seems to be the best call. Provided I don't get destroyed horribly. Enemy's still trying to push forward. Whatever. Defend that province, please. Thank you. Goodness gracious. So, this is not going so... We have no opportunities for encirclements yet because these guys are stuck at a port. 
they're stuck in a port and we cannot destroy them just yet. Just focus on pushing the militia out, please. Just do that. Do not send any of those units down here. Have one unit to watch them. One unit's going to be here. The rest are going to focus on everything else. So new plan. New plan, okay? Six divisions here. Yes. That's going to be the main push there. And these guys got to move down here and watch that. Don't have any of the actual... First army units, watch out those trap. Watch for those trapped units in that port tile because in that province, if we focus too hard on it, we may end up moving too many troops away. At least it's two divisions that are basically stuck. Okay, it's not too bad of an issue. At least punch through here, and then we can actually encircle some units instead of just being stuck doing what we're doing now. They may take Langenberg back. That may not be too bad of a situation for us though. If they do take it back. And they're moving some units away. This might actually get an actual encirclement going. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, have those units stop, please. And then... And I think with that, I'm going to end with part 6 of my Kingdom of Manitoba playthrough in the Hearts of Iron. 4 mod, Old World Blues here. If you enjoyed the mod, you can check it out in the video description. The link to it is there. If you enjoyed the video itself, make sure to like and subscribe.